Hello and welcome back to my channel Show Wizards Farming Simulator 2019 Missions uh, Specifically I want to talk about grass missions uh, Something that the game obviously offers you to fertilize, mow or whatever else it does, bale, I'm not really sure uh, on the actual grass missions themselves, I've not experienced them in game as yet so if you have leave a comment what the actual game offers you as far as grass missions go but when looking at the editor side of things um, when you're creating a map for example you have the ability to offer that particular mission to whatever field you want to decide so the grass mission will only ever be offered on whatever fields you tell it to to um, apply it to and we do that with a, a user attribute so you'll need to look at your map and decide which field you want to set up for that particular mission parameter um, doesn't really matter I would probably say uh, not to include the ones that are set up as default property at the start of a new game save if you're playing on easy mode or new farmer choose one of the others uh, so if I was going to set these fields up here uh, like the default Felsburn map um, where you get a certain set of fields over here I forget which ones it is because I've deleted quite a few for different things to do with my video tutorials but you get a, a couple of fields over here and then obviously your um, farm buildings and grain silo and whatever else I wouldn't include those ones however you set them up to do your default uh, property at the start of a new game save but any other field that you're not going to own at the start of a new game save choose one of those and all you do is just come into here so I would say for example maybe field 5 which is over here and then make sure you've got the main transform group for the actual field itself selected and then open up your user attributes window to so just go window and then user attributes and then type in the actual parameter or the new user attribute here so what we want to do is go field grass mission again make sure as always that you have the uppercase and lowercase letters in the right places select boolean in the drop down which is by default already selected and then click add and then to apply that you just need to put a tick in the box pretty straightforward so then if I wanted to do another field maybe field 19 which is this one over here I would just again make sure I'm on the field main field transform group for that particular field setup <clears throat> and then again just come in to the uh, new attribute field grass mission make sure you're on boolean as the type click add and put a tick in the box and that's it now I have two fields on the entire map that will be set up to offer a grass mission um, and that, that's pretty much it there's nothing further to do with it as far as I'm aware there's no way of turning them on or turning them off in game they are set up in the editor via the user attributes as you've just seen there so if you wanted to specifically turn them off you would have to unzip the map come into the editor find which fields are set up for grass missions and then just take the tick out of the box I guess you could always just delete the user attribute but I would probably say if the user attributes there just by taking the tick out of the box you can go back into game test it and as long as you don't get any errors or whatever else you can you're good to go but if you delete it and then you start getting errors and things like that you'll obviously have to add the user attribute back in again um, so it might be just beneficial to leave the attribute there but just take the tick out of the box uh, so it becomes false not true um, but I'm not sure how the grass missions work into the game mechanic um, it might be possible that if you don't have them there it will cause problems uh, the game will be requesting a grass mission but it won't see a field on the map that actually has that parameter set up so then that could cause some errors I'm not entirely sure on that so just be a little bit careful when you're working around it and trying to turn them off if you don't like the grass missions for whatever reason and you want to deactivate them by means come into the editor and have a bit of a play and see what you can do with it by just deactivating them here and test it out but um, I'm not sure what the consequences of that would be again it might cause the uh, game to freak out and cause you some problems uh, you know that's that's really all there is to it it's not you know um, anything further that needs to be done done there 
I'm Shell Wizard. Thanks very much for watching, and I'll catch you on the next one.